Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you're doing well. Thank you very much for coming join the stream so early on. Diego versus Paloma. Jolly's Ghost, which is, I'm assuming that's Ethan again. I forget. Kieran and Aiden, thank you very much for coming join the stream. Hope you are doing well. And we are going to be starting the Orlando Pirates. It is, I remembered. Now, just when Chris comes in, I've got to remember his new name. We shall see. So, we're back with Orlando Pirates. Something a little bit different than I'm doing today with the stream is similar to what I did yesterday. Is I'm actually simul streaming this on Twitch and YouTube. So, if you see me responding to a chat message that you can't see in the chat, it's probably from the other platform. I'm just seeing how things go. I'm just seeing how things go right now. But I just want to test it out, see what, see what works, see if this program works and uh, see if it's actually any good at the minute it's working okay it's just my chat's in two different places but it is what it is so we are going back with the orlando pirates if you missed um, last week if you missed the last the last episode we signed the lord bentner because we can did that sound actually work hang on I need to turn up a little bit. Can you hear the hallelujahs okay? Or does it need turning up a little bit more? Good morning, Matt. So if we've got the goal sound. Okay, yep, uh, that'll do for now then. Cool. First time using that, so that's cool. So, yeah, we've got, we, we bought Bender just so we can have the, the, the what you call it, the mean teams. Aiden, that is completely up to you. It is your own choice. The reason why I'm doing it to both is a reason why um, I've said before is I just want to, the way YouTube works right now is not a great, it's not, what it used to be so i'm just testing the waters to see what happens and i did an hour's stream yesterday 50 minutes roughly of borderlands the pre-sequel and i got three two sorry two copyright notifications on the youtube side of things because of the music that was in the game so i was a little bit peeved by that but you know what it is it is what it is so, yes, Matt, it is long time no see. How are things with you? And, yeah, um, sorry to see the current state of um, effects, um, current state of things with your football club and the ground situation. Has there been any more, has there been any more progress with that? Have you actually been able to settle down where you're going to be playing next year's home games? Hmm. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's why, that's why I put my own music on. That's why I put my own music on, and um, I mute the FIFA music. So it's um, I, I've done that. I didn't do that for the first episode of the Grimsby this year, and he just flag, flag, flagged within five minutes of the video being up. So it was kind of annoying. But you know, if I want to play through different games and do playthroughs. At different times I might do those ones on Twitch because it might just be save me a pain it might just stop um, it being a pain in the backside if you know what I mean but yeah it is what it is so we're going into the first game of this now oops oh no I didn't mean to do that I do not eat bananas I actually don't eat bananas don't like the taste right so seems we haven't changed it for two episodes YouTube chat is there anything because this is your player do we have to can we change anything to make you feel better i prefer orange i prefer oranges and grapes if i'm being honest for fruit wise so we're going to change his name you want to be number seven okay so we'll check i'll change the number seven while we're waiting to see if anyone else wants anything else to be changed I like bananas. That's fair enough. And ev everyone is entitled to their own opinion. Change kit number. 
Nah, he's not Ronaldo. Yeah, he does look... He looks so much like Ronaldo, doesn't he? He does look like Ronaldo. I mean, you're zooming on that face and you just think, is this guy Ronaldo? Is he? He looks like it. I mean, look. The cheeky grin, the face. Ronaldo. Definitely. Oh, have we got... Um, what number of Ben I got? I didn't. I, I'm gutted I didn't because I... What was it? It was... I wasn't doing anything much, but I I honestly didn't want I didn't want to watch it. I thought it wasn't going to be that interesting of a game, and I was just like, what? Yeah, I know we we've got the Lord Matt. I just I we done it for the lols really because we've got we've got the meme stream we've got the meme stream dream team now. Is that the right way to say it? But anyway, with um. With you, with the um, chat being as big as he is, and then we've got the Lord up front for memes. So what we'll try and do is uh, try. We might create. We might do youth youth players and meme players. So we might try and get um, some more meme players in just for just for giggles, basically. Ajax might win the Champions League. I am. I would like Ajax to win the Champions League to prove that. They are called a selling club, which I don't agree with, but they are called a selling club, and um, yeah, it's not it's nice to say that they're a selling club because Ajax in their tradition is that they are one of the forces in Europe, so to speak. Do I know what AFL is? I do know what the Aussie Football League is. I have watched a couple of the highlights and some of the games in it's on BT Sports sometimes, but I, I can say that I, ha I haven't watched anything to do with it in the past three or four months. I used to watch some of the highlights when I wake up early, but to be perfectly honest, in a minute, I keep waking up and putting on um, YouTube streams. Because it's fun. And I'm watching, currently, when I'm not playing games, I'm watching someone do a playthrough of the original Saints Row. Because I just love it. But anyway, uh, yeah, I actually used to be a force. Like gro growing up, when I was growing up, like they, they had Burkamp, they had you had a Zlatan when he was young as well. So Dwight McNeil now, then the Lord flies it off over Femi, Gibbs right with the dribbler, and that was an awful shot. Yeah, and so I actually were at like one of the forces. Van der Sar started there as well, and then moved off. So I would like to see Ajax win, but not at the expense of an English team. So if Liverpool or Spurs are in the final, I would like either Liverpool or Spurs to win. Bentner. Bentner's bit of space. Oh, Lord, Bentner. <laughs> We've got a goal and it is, hallelujah, Lord Bentner. Lord Bentner with the goal. Let's celebrate. It's a great finish. Radford will be relegated. Do you like my change to my name and my pick? Uh, uh, Fizz, to be perfectly honest with you, if you tell me who you were before, then I can answer you honestly. Because I so can't, if you've just changed your name, I don't know who you are. I'm assuming, if it's going on yesterday, I'm thinking it might be Rick JMR. Oh, yes, sorry. I can't quite tell. Y your picture looks cool. Why is he called the Lord Ben? I forget where he come from. I forget where it was, where it originally started. But it was, I think it was around um, his time of leaving Arsenal. At the end, he just got the he got the nickname Lord Bender from somewhere. I don't know why. McNeil, we're going to try and get it up for chat at the back post, but no, obviously blocked. 
but I can't remember the full reason why. It's just ever since then he's been known as the Lord, and that's been the meme. Chat with the head. Chat with the goal. It's like Ronaldo with the goal because he looks like Ronaldo. I, for, I forget how to do the Ronaldo. Someone, can you tell me how to do the Ronaldo celebration where he does the spin? Because I'm going to have to remember that and do that for chat. I'm going to have to remember to do that for chat. It's a good header though. Off the weed head and then goes in. Oh, sorry, I can't say weed. Can't on YouTube. <coughs> sorry. So do you think do you think you'll beat Bradford today, Matt? You should do really. Looking for teammates in the middle. Fantastic goal. Okay. You Find some good head. Did not see that come. I just assumed that my defender was going to get his head on the ball there. Wow. He's a great header. <laughs> Defenders caught out by it in the end. Pronounce that name, Vegan Spam. Name. Um, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say that missing stuff is how you get called a lord. You usually, get to get given a lordship, you have to do something good. A little run over it and just over the bar. It was something around his time at Arsenal he did it. Fair enough. He's amazing right now. He gives us the lead. I can't take anything about it. Gomez looking for chat. Use your strength. Well, you're twice the size of that bullet. Twice the size of him. Eating for breakfast. Get a little dink ball in again. Can't get that dink in. Oh, Oberfemi gets it round. Oberfemi still in. Good save. Wonderful reflexes to make the save from close range. Good strength, Diang. Oh, and you go and do that. At uh, Barca Man U, it was a clinic. Basically, it was it was Manu being what about 75%, at least 70, uh, probably pl only playing at 75%, and then and then uh, what you call it, and then Barcelona playing at 100. So it was a it was a non-class, and then there was just little mistakes that creeped into United game. I mean De Gea, who was usually he was usually United saviour is the one that cost cost them the second goal. So, you know, it's it's difficult to say. It's difficult to say the what was letting United down more, the overall performance or individual mistakes. Was was Ole's tactics not right for that day or would it have been okay minus the mistakes? You never know. But it is what it, it is what it is. Spurs Tottenham, Spurs Tottenham was just watching the highlights back. Just looked like a proper game of two high-quality teams going at it, but with not the best defending. It's it's what happens when good attacking players go against average defenders, which is what Spurs and Man City made their own other defenses look like. And I'm trying too much to pass it about here. Um, so, I would love that. 
and I, I think that all English ties tend to bring out that kind of game. I mean, you look back at what was it, Liverpool, Man City a couple of years ago, two very hotly contested semi-finals to get into the final. Um, you know, it was absolutely brilliant games. I mean, it's just a pity we're not going to have an all English semi-final because that would have it would have just made the entertainment that little bit better, in my opinion. Over Femi, bit of space, trying for the curl just wide. You know, so it, it's it's that it's that kind of thing. Good morning, BFG. Well, good evening for you, BFG. Sorry, good afternoon, good evening. Because I forget that you're in the Aussie land. But um, and Diang cannot finish to save his life. But summer transfer predictions. I have not a clue. I have not a clue. Um, I can't. I can't even predict it right now. There was. There's a, a player, Frankie De Jong, the one from Ajax. He's going to be the one that's going to make the most noise money-wise, unless Neymar or someone like that decides to opt out of their contracts and go somewhere else. I don't know. But Frankie De Jong is probably the one like. The Mbappe transfer a couple of year a couple of years ago. That's going to be the big transfer of the summer. Because I even if Ajax win the Champions League, I don't think they'll keep him. I don't think they'll be able to keep him with the amount of money that will be thrown at him. Um, but other than that, I'm not too certain. Good morning, Ricky. I thought you were changing your name to try and throw me off, so ha. Uh, What on earth was that header? What on earth was that header? That was a cracking header. From what, the penalty spot? That's from behind the penalty spot and you put it in top bins. <laughs> Dear Lord. Um, as for the Champions League final, we'll see who gets there, but I would like the winner of the Ajax Tottenham. The winner of the Ajax Tottenham final to um, to to go and win it personally, but that's me. Good play, Gomez. Gibbs White. Oh, touches it too far. Damn it. If Man United sign Petr Cech. If that's what I've just seen, then that is a backwards move if I've ever seen it. Gomez, unlucky. Hello Paddy, hope you're doing well. I think De Gea probably is going to lead, leave, sorry, not lead. He is probably going to leave, but signing Petr Cech, Petr Cech is not a replacement. It would be a replacement for Lee Grant, who is the third choice keeper at United. But that is the only that is the only way that he is um, going to get signed. I'm going to have to get after the end because I don't just not. I'm going to try and keep her out there. Well, that's the thing, but you've got to you've got to look somewhere. Carius is a replacement. All Liverpool fans would well love that if Carius went there. Great tackle, Ampadu. I'm going to throw this game away now. <sighs> Thought I had done that. Oblak is probably the, the one that would replace him. And Oblak is 
of that nature. Who else has been... There's been someone else that's been rumoured that, that an English... and I don't know whether it's an English keeper or a... It's a home nation's keeper anyway. I'm just trying to think because it's not Pickford. I don't done a rumour either. I've done a rumour as... Um, Greenwood. Oh, good save by the keeper. And what's going on here? We've got a penalty. We've got a penalty. Get in. Cheers, thanks, Paddy. Right, YouTube. Right, chat, where are we going? Chat, where are we going? This is up to you now. You are taking this penalty. Where are we going? Not Butland. I don't know. I don't know where he... I, I've not a clue now. It's, um, if that's true, then that's fair enough. But I, I've not a clue if he's going to down the left. Again, it would be a, a legit... A, uh, what do you call it? It could be a logical kind of thing for him to move there. Alright, chat. Okay, so you don't want to pick. That's fine. Top left. Okay. Oops, I didn't hit it hard enough. It's alright, bottom left still worked. I didn't want to hit it too far. But, yep, we scored, chat scored, and you told me where to go. Hey, if, if, Levin, if Rob, if Lewandowski goes, he'll be two more years. Or if Bayern get a younger, if Bayern get a younger person to start putting pressure on him and make sure that he doesn't play as many minutes. That's the only way that Lewandowski thinks about moving somewhere. In my opinion because that's what happened to Rooney he got pressured um, by the media and obviously the English media is more brutal than anywhere else in the world apart from Italy but um, yeah Rooney started to get harried in the press saying he's not good enough and then that, that led into his team play he didn't quite fit in to the new role that United were um, playing him and that's when you know, the, the opportunity came for him to go to MLS. But, um, Rob, if unless Bayern start to move, want to move him, then I don't see him going that way. Because Muller hasn't gone that way. And Muller's way older. I'm getting the pass off. Showing that my FIFA skills are a little bit rusty. Oh, no, 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 no. And can they score their third head? Oh, you are kidding me with that defending. Yeah, that, I mean, that is, the, that is the case, but it's the problem that Australia has is it doesn't have the media market of China or Japan or America. He doesn't have that financial clout. It's like if you look at where all the big um, sponsors are, they're in America, they're in Asia, you know. Bentner! Damn you, Lord Bentley. Oh, it was going top bins as well. Yes, you should. JMR, you absolutely should have it. You should have Crunchy Nut. Everyone should have Crunchy Nut for breakfast. If you don't have Crunchy Nut for breakfast, you've got to have bacon. It's been a great contest. And no one has got their noses in front now with five minutes to go. Crafting the through pass. Nearly. Yeah, that's the rules. That that's chat rules now, that is. 
you don't if you don't have crunchy nut for breakfast you've got to have bacon Greenwood's in on you <laughs> yes get in little Greenwood is Greg's English up from somewhere else I have not a clue I do not know what made Greg's all I know all I know is that Greg's fills the arteries of 90% of English people so you know I I can't eat Greg's but I know what it's like come to Scotland Ethan I will be going to Scotland in August I'll be going on holiday for a week in, uh, I forget the actual where I'm going. I'm going to like the northern reaches of Scotland with part of my wife's family, so it should be fun. Can't wait. Oh, come on, Ben, can you rip me? I feel, well, Rooney, okay, fair enough. Yeah, anyone speaks better English than Wayne Rooney. I mean, Wayne Rooney, Wayne Rooney speaks caveman English. Harry Kane, I feel a little bit sorry for, because obviously he was, um, when he was younger, he had a speech impediment. So, you know, he kind of struggled to speak English, obviously because of his lisp and speech impediment. So, it kind of was a little bit more difficult for him to openly speak English. And he's done well. And we win that game. Victory. And how is Gibbs White on my remark? Ken could have been. Ken who? Ken. There's loads of people called Ken. KD bit really? KDB could have been English. Then we could have had the King of Gingers and the Prince of Gingers. We don't kill us. Stupid. De Bruyne, what are you doing? Jack Simpson has returned from injury. That shores up our defence a little bit. And gives us a bit of better options than Kai Marcelo, who I'm not overly thrilled with. Hughes can come in for Hoover, who has not done anything wrong. It's just, I think with him playing out of position, it's not the best for him. And we're going to try Sabiri on this left, on this right, because I'm not. I'm not happy with Diangana. How old is the Lord? Um, 30? Yeah, 30. So 31. It's true. It's like Arsenal. We could have had Ronaldo. We could have had Messi. Hey. Uh, vale. Come on. If I'm talking about Vale. I, I am. He's my super sub in the midfield at the minute. But seeing as you have just requested a JMR, he is playing, he is starting the next game. I'm simming this game just to get it forward, just to move it forward a little bit, and then I'll play the next one. So we're simming against Kaiser Slouten. How's Paul Vale doing? We're not doing too bad. Hey. Vale also could have had money for Jordan Hugo, but he went straight into the back pocket of the flipping owner. Victory. But, but no. Uh, yeah, so we get the win. 2 1 against Kaiser Slauten. Pirates beat Kaiser Slauten. I like saying Kaiser Slauten. Kaiser Slauten is Kaiser Slauten. And if Kaiser Slauten is Kaiser Slauten. Kaiser Slauten, Kaiser Slauten, Kaiser Slauten. I just like the way it feels in my mouth. It's very good. It's awesome. Lovely name. Chat, you are coming on well. You still haven't got a 60 rating just yet. We'll have a quick look. Yeah, I'm, and, uh, I'm, I'm not surprised, BFG, because that was just awful, what happened. And um, it, it's, it'll, it'll happen. You know, uh, it, it, it will hopefully 
reckon he'll get over it soon. Because the best way to get over stuff like that is to kind of go forward with it. Let's have a look at your attributes then. So you, your pace is still shown in the 54s, your physicals at 50s, but shooting, passing, dribbling, 57s. Have got anything that's naturally grown other than the training? I don't think so. No, it doesn't look like anything has developed other than your crossing. Sorry, other than what we've trained, which is not too bad, but you're at 50s across the board. So, yeah. Well, kit numbers change. Boot, boot changes when we reach milestones. So, at the minute, you, um, the next milestone, so we've got the basic black boots, and then the EA Sports basic black, and then we go up to a set with the striping, the next one up. When he gets to 15 goals for the season, did we say? Did we say 15 goals for the season? He gets an upgrade on his boots, something like that. Or if he gets like player of the month, he gets an upgrade, that kind of thing for his boots. He gets like, we're treating it as if it's like it's a boot sponsorship kind of thing. That's how we're kind of dealing with it. I'm going to report on Miley because we might get him as well. So, um, the next game we're going to get away against Lottie, who, where are they in the league? 17th out of 20, okay, they've only got 5 points so far and only 1 win, so we're going to lose this game, because, you know, this is just what the game does to us, so we're obviously going to lose. And Longstaff is in the middle. Oh, got to show you this. Say hello to my newest addition to my gaming center, my gaming attire, Senor Cactus. He's a right little fluffy boy. Well, I've wanted a cactus for years, and we now have Senor Cacti on here. So it is our new, my new lucky paraphernalia of the... Um, and uh, my, my, what you call it, my, my wife, I was going to say fiancé, no, we've been married for nearly two, for, oh, over two today. months now. The yeah, we've been married for two months and she got me a cactus. Yeah. Senor Cacti is looking over to us. So if we do something wrong, then I'm going to get pricked. Literally, I'm going to get pricked. Hello, everybody. Martin Tyler but yeah. Is my name. Alan Smith is what games are you looking forward to this weekend? Oh, it's obviously really been Easter. There's obviously an extended schedule out this afternoon any of you going to those games i am going to the veil game it will be my it will unfortunately be the last game last veil game i can attend this season so i'm making sure that i'm going to that cannot wait and just while just while we're starting this game up there will be no stream tomorrow morning unfortunately um, I've got some actual adult real life stuff to do, so yeah, sucks, but part of growing up. Oh damn, that was a terrible pass. Oh dear, playing that about well. Oh exactly, who wants to who wants to watch a League Two team? I do, I do, I do. Okay, well that's a. F How is that not a free kick? And I'm. Oh my dear, Ampadu, do not lose that there. Yeah, well, I I'm blaming everything on you, Ricky. Anyway, if they lose today, I'm blaming it on you. I'm just literally, I'm going to just scream if they lose. Damn you, Ricky, at the top of my entire voice. But if fail win, then I'm just gonna say it's all my fault. This is an exercise in patience. They try to get an opening. Oh, Ben, get it! Oh, ben, I just wish you were quicker, a little bit quicker. BFG, I, I, as, mu as much as I don't want to sound insensitive, I think all those moments of silence, obviously, the the remembrance, we we did all that 
when um, as nations and as individuals we'll have all had our own kind of um, moments of silence, moments of reflection, mem moments of reflection um, in and around the incident when it actually ha when it actually happened. Um, I think it's best to do that when it means something to certain people. I mean, if you if people want to have moments of reflection on their own, then that's fine. But um, I think with stuff like that, it's better when it means something rather than just arbitrarily doing it for the sake of doing it. Nearly a well worked goal. I think. I think for me, that on FIFA, on uh, FIFA anyway, I'm. I'm used to playing with people like Rashford and um, Mbappe, where the passes are spot on, and I can do this intricate one-two play. Whereas now, obviously with lesser quality players, I am struggling a little bit to get the move passing and movement going. It'll get there. Like that, we got through. But it was a good save in the end. And again, we're going to try and get it in so Chuck can get his big beefy dome on this. And Chat with the good save, uh, good, the good shot from range. Sorry, not good save. Oh, well, look, Femi. He's just diabolical. Have another go. Defended well. That will be a corner. Here comes the corner. Good defensive clearance there. Good position for the cross. Still haven't got used to this team properly. Oh, on, that was a great tackle from Sabiri. Get rid. Oh dear. Risky. Oh, come on, clear it. That's a better. of skill and will to hold off the opposition. That's a good ball for Nick Neal. Couldn't oh, touch too far. And he's knocked it out of play, the defender. Delivered into the box. Oh, it's a good ball in, but oh, we're not going to be able to get the chat. Get in! Oh, right place, right time, and this time with your foot. Chat, you've been able to sweep it home to give us the lead. Dangerous ball and good defending initially, but the keeper's punch was not promising enough. And it was a great, great little finish. How's the quality of the gameplay and everything? Is the stream okay? No pixel, no like drop frames or anything like that. Good. That's good to hear. Oh, Dwight. Good, 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 good. No, we haven't forced our keeper into a save yet. Long stuff. Good header. Obafemi, bad header. Oh, chat. Good interception. Bentner, don't lose the ball. And now he's looking for some support. Into Obafemi. Oh, the ball back now. oh yeah, it's, it, go get some food. Mate. You can pause the stream and you can pick it back up. 
Until he makes I promise you won't miss anything. Quick, let me score a good goal while Ethan's away. Sorry, did I say that? Yeah, we've got some space with Gibbs White now. Oh, that is a great shot. That is, a, that is an amazing shot, Gibbs White. I, 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 Ethan, I do not blame you. Mate. Do not blame you at all. Now, now, given the opportunity of being able to stay in bed, watch YouTube, or play video games, I think 90% of people in the world would just rather stay in bed than get, have to get up for any reason, other than if they need the toilet, because obviously staying in bed and needing the toilet is not good. Where's robots at? What? Robots? So we'll restart with a throw in. Robot? Mm, I'm guessing autocorrect hit something there. Well, here comes the support. Ben are working a bit of space. Good save. Oh yeah, well that's why I'm not at work today as well. Feels like a Saturday morning, especially with Vale playing in the afternoon. I'm off, ne I'm off next week from work as well, so expect a couple more streams from me next week, providing I'm not busy. But we might get like an hour or so in in the mornings. You know, for all those that are still on their Easter holidays. The parents are still working. Well, that's the thing. It's like I would normally be, if I was in my old job, I normally would be working today. Because I used to all used to work every single bank holiday. What team is they? Get out! Get out! What team is Vale? How dare you? You call yourself a loyal viewer? How dare you? Support Vale? <laughs> you know. Uh, at least I can't blame you for anything, Ricky. But why do you watch Chelsea then? Ooh. Yeah, I should, I should be able to get streaming on Monday. Definitely Monday morning. I'll get streaming on Monday morning for you, Ricky. So what time... Rick, just so I know, just so when... Because I know some, some people are back at school. What time do you finish school and get home then? Is it like 3, 3.30, something like that? Finish at 3.30, that kind of thing. Oh, long stuff. It's just so I know, because then if I if I do schedule another stream in for say the third part of that, um, what game do you want me to see a playthrough of? Then I know roughly what time to start it. I need to start it and finish it for about three. I need to make sure that it's done by three twenty. That's what I need to do. Oh no, Vale is a small team. Oh, Ethan, and I'm just joking. I'm just joking when I say how dare you. You know, because there's a lot of people that 
don't they don't have to see they don't have to see what you call it they don't they don't see anything outside of the top leagues it's fine no no I make sure at 320 so you don't have to watch me and I don't get to blame you I'm thinking for your sanity but Oh, I messed up that. Yeah, because just the, for the amount of fails. Yeah, that's true. And the poor defending. That's true. That's true. Well, you look at a Lincoln game earlier on this year where they won 6 2 away at a, an absolutely abysmal team. He's offside, thank you. Fine, Ethan. It's perfectly fine. Chat, you're coming off for a rest. Keita, come off over Femi. Everyone is shattered. Longstaff, unfortunately, you're going to have to come off for the own goal. Oh, it's offside. That's what the assistant has said. Well, when he looks back on that, I think he might be a bit disappointed because the striker seemed to time his run Hughes. really well. That's a straightforward piece of work for the goalkeeper. No, two seasons ago. We've, we've played Lincoln for the past two seasons, so it's three seasons ago they were in non-league. That's not a bad ball. Oh, I waited too long. Yeah, he did a good. He did, yeah, when they had that run, they did, they were brilliant with the Cowley brothers as the manager. It was a good story. But I will just say now, the Cowley brothers, when you manage, when you play against them, they are idiots, and I hate them. They surround the fourth official. And I, I mean surround. It's like any any half decision, whether it goes for them or against them, they are around them. Keita. <laughs> 90th minute, the super sub. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Love a little move there to get inside and a good little chipped finish. 90th minute, geez, Nikita from Arsenal. Beautiful. Yeah. Yes! Victory! Oh, no. Black is his orange. Black is his completely orange. I own orange, yes, orange everything. Before he broke, before he broke, I had an orange today, Xbox Alan. controller. What a time to step up to the plate. The big players respond to the big occasion. He certainly did there with that. Orange Nerf guns. I'm not gonna find I have nearly everything orange. So Rackers is orange. Manchester will always be red. Yeah, the reason why I've got a blue chair is because the orange chairs look horrible. So, yeah, the blue chair is comfortable, but to have an orange chair like this, it is 
it would be awful. And I'm just going to have like a nice little chill, relax for a little bit. Because that last game was actually flipping tense. No, not really. My dad's second team is Man City. Always has been for some reason, don't understand why. Ethan, don't bother, please, mate. Stop it. No, but not with that. Not. Don't try and just incite things. It's just not, not good. It is to a certain extent. He's under. He's not. He's not crap. He's inexperienced in those kind of games. Other than as a manager, he's inexperienced. Draw for the first time in a while. Oh, shit, let's have a look. I think it's. It, I think more of the case of he's not fighting for anything right now. When he come in, he was. When he come in, it was easy for him to make changes and have a positive influence. It was really, really easy for him to do that because of how negative everything was under Mourinho so for him now it's kind of a little bit more difficult because now he's got to improve and I, th I agree with Ricky saying it's partly down to the people who are not fit and he's having to play he's not having to play how he really wants to play because he would like to play a certain style of football, but it looks like that that certain style of football depends on players X, Y, and Z being in that team. Now, unfortunately, players X, Y, and players X, Y, and Z aren't there. It's kind of a little bit annoying that he can't play that certain positions. He can't get this. He can't get that. It's annoying. And football fan Reese, thank you very much for saying who who you support Rackers Gaming. I support Paul Vale because I, I'm gloating for punishment, basically. London, to an extent, I would say London is blue because Chelsea are slightly the better team in the minute, but also Spurs have partly blue in there as well. Now, for Ollie's possession, it's definitely counter. It's 100% counter attack. And he relies on certain people. What was I going to do? I was going to do something. What was I going to do? What was I going to do? Oh, I was just forgot. Doing something. What was I doing? Youth. That's it. That's my youth squad. Have I only got two youth scouts? No, I haven't. Okay, so I wonder. I thought something was going wrong. Okay, so fair enough. There's no real thing from there. Right, where are we going to send? I'm going to send this one because we're in Germany. So we might as well send Gross to Germany. And we'll go for any player again. So where are we, where are we going to send these other two? Um, as a I, I agree a little bit. I agree that Young is probably done in the first team at the end of this season. I completely agree that he's probably not not going to get as many first team chances come the end of the season. But I don't think I don't think he should retire. The main reason why I don't think he, he should retire is because you're going to be losing Valencia, Mata and Herrera potentially at the end of the season. And so if United are honestly thinking about pushing forward and getting the top team, in, being the top team in England and also getting into European finals, then they need some experience, not necessarily on the playing side, on the pitch. But Ashley Young in the dressing room 
in the dressing room is where he probably would be more beneficial. So you keep him in and around. You keep him on the fringes of the team just so he can help with experience because of like the people like Rashford. Obviously, you've got younger players coming through. They need that kind of steadying influence. They need that kind of old head, that, um, that person who's been there, done that, been in the situation before. And they need that calming influence that kind of thing and it's it stops a young team from trying to overreach and overthink brings them back down to earth and basically just says look you've had a bad game so what you know you you get to make amends for it next week but what you've got to do is you've got to do it in the right way and that's where i think ashley young's new role is you know You know, I think, I, I, I think that he needs, he, he would need to um, basically just step back and become a, a, very, a very much a fringe player. That's what I think. He needs to, he needs to turn himself into a fringe player. You know, and that's what Young needs to do. Because Dallow is going to be his replacement. At the, at the club of the mini, Dallow is his replacement. Because Dallow is looking very good very very good but you need another you need another person because Dallow's a lot more attacking so you probably need Ashley Young there just to steady him and just tutor him for probably six months and then Ashley Young probably retire going to coaching next seat at the end of next season yeah probably Coleman at, Chal at um, Everton has probably gone past it I, but unfortunately, I think that's more to down to injuries rather than um, I think that's more down to his injuries rather than down to he's just he's lost his talent because unfortunately he suffered that doubt that those leg breaks were just all horrible. Luke Shaw surprises me how he's actually come back well, from two is, serious the broken the legs. Of our match today. To and come back and live. still be the player, he, he, the decent player he is now. Play do I like? Trippier would be a good signing. Play do I like for Everton? Sigurdsson, when he actually wants to play. Nice to have you with us. Calvert Lewin Signing is starting in. to get um, higher in my opinion, but I I, I, I really do like Adam Ola Lookman. I'd like here. to see him get a decent Kick run off. in an Everton team. Or if he doesn't get a decent well, run in the Everton team, team the then side. go to a slightly lesser Premier League tied and get and get a decent run in there because he's good. I, re I really do highly rate Adam Ola Lucas. Why did you say that Trippier wouldn't come to United, um, Ricky? This looks promising. Oh, it's going to be tough, Change definitely. Feet. Simpson. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Ooh, what position do you play, Ethan? Did well to get what to position? It. Hasn't really finished the job. Great work by the goalkeeper. The ball is his, and he's made sure he's protected it. Plenty of width for the team to attack into. He's had a look at the ref, he knows what's coming. It's not an occasion here of the player going to get a, a second chance. You play every position. Straight away. That's a bit of a burden at this early in the match. Well, it is, but I don't think he can have too many complaints. He's, he's dived That's in good and ball in. Oh, just can't get the head on it. It's a great turn and turn into a great close, that is. Sawi. He's got pace to flanks. burn. Away for a kick. He's in Champions League semi final. Spurs are coming under a massive project. It won't be a part of it. I completely agree with you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I completely agree with that. Yeah, that's a, that's a logical reason for him not to join. But it's um, it depends on where his loyalties lie. Because he might just say. I want to join United because 
United are a, a, a big club. He, he might just want to tick that off and say that I played for United. Some players are like that. And he might get only one opportunity to do it. Oh, Bentner. Oh, Bentner. And hello, Chris. I've only just seen your message before I popped up. Jeez. Oh, Sancho, I would like to see back in England, you know, but that's what's going on. Chat, what are you doing? Oh, my controls died, that's why. I would like to see Sancho back in England, in England but yeah. Adam Wait, I know we signed Bentner for the, the memes, but come on, Bentner, you've got to score for it to actually be beneficial for him. But anyway, good, good, good Chris, yourself? Sabiri, yes! Now I know if we had Dian Garner out there, he would not have scored that. Phew. Phew. But yeah, I mean, and Ethan, probably I'd sign you for a bacon sandwich in London. So we're talking about six quid. The main reason, you're unproven. And I don't think you would hack it in the Premier Leagues. I see, so, so. Thing is, it's like when you're an when you're an amateur footballer or you're just an aspiring footballer and anything like that, you kind of you kind of just hope that someone wants to sign you, wants to pay you to play, because everywhere you go, you have to pay a membership fee and then subs every single game. So you get to the stage where you go, so you're like, wouldn't it just be nice if someone paid me to play, even if it is a quid, you know? Oh, Bentner. Oh! <laughs> oh, Bentner. Okay, he misses the easy ones. Let's do it again. He misses the easy ones and then... Dear Lord. That is a great finish. Lord is memeing. Ah, he's a great goal. <laughs> that is just phenomenal. Ethan, I'm sorry, I cannot buy you. I cannot buy you any cake, mate. I'm sorry. Perfect to be able to get that through. Slept through my alarms, 11 hours sleep. Hey, it's Good Friday, and I'm assuming you haven't got work or any kind of commitments to do today, Chris, so enjoy it. Enjoy it. Really get in at the goalkeeper, running off the defender, but he's run offside. I don't know, I'm got game head, I'm got game sounds. I don't game sounds coming through any headphones. Um well, the goalkeeper looked oh around and think he might have been hoping it was going over the bar, but it went underneath it. Whether the goal scorer actually sliced that one actually go where he intended. Off we go again. No, no game sound. Oh there you go. Okay, so let me so Brazil. Settings. Can I, I can't 
can't, I can't change the commentary in game, can I? Right. Remind me in the lobby to do that because I can't do it in game mid game. So remind me in the lobby. Do you think the only meaner needs a game next season was Everton is injured? Um, I don't know. Um, the only meaner was I was one one of those um, acquisitions for Everton that I was a little bit unsure of. So I'm not sure. We'll try Brazil next. We'll try Brazil next game and then Spain the game after. Angle is so glad I got the hallelujah sound for Lord Bentley. So glad. He nicks it at the near post. Bentley gets his second of the game. He's alright from six yards. Or when he's on a spinning half volley. Just, just mad. What a pass that was! <laughs> I would love it if that is what they see. Really get at the opposition here. Oh, long staff gets bullied. Femi rolls his man, shoots straight at the keeper. I say, I remember hearing a chant saying, it's like, you're only winning 2-0. Oh, it's something, oh, what was it? No. I can't, oh, I can't remember. It's something like, we're only losing 1-0 or we're only losing 2-0. How will we from the UV? We're only losing 2-0. We're only losing something like that. But I've just messed up and give them a second goal. And Dorfler has got his second of the game. Oh, chat. <laughs> Falls down in between the ref's legs. It would be good if they, if they put that kind of stuff in. The, into the fucking game. That would just be hilarious. That's it. Yep, that's it. That's the one. That's the one. Thank you, Ethan. I mean, sometimes it is just funny to put in um, on YouTube. It's like the funniest football chance or sports chance or something like that because they're just some of them are just ridiculous. I mean, the one for Balotelli, the one, one that they did for Balot, Man City fans did for Balotelli was quite funny because he, he basically says when he plays his when he plays his effing class. No, sorry. He's got an allergy for grass, but when he plays, he's effing class. Just stupidly funny. And obviously the the Torre one, the ya 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 Torre Colo 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 Torre. They did that in the Davies Cup for the tennis, I believe, where they mixed it up for the Murray brothers. Oh, Sabiri, can he get his head on it? No. Great tackle, good work. Oh, yeah. I'll be right there. Opening them up with a free pass. Safety first 
chance of defending there by Erb. Well, there's still time to hit back in this game, and they're going to try and do it with a substitute. It's a good ball in again. Try to get a quick shot off with Bentley. Oh, yeah, it's true. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. 3 3. Oh, good save, Dolberg. That's it. Yep. Yep, yep. I forgot about that. Obviously, some of them are wrong, but some of them are just so wrong that we're not even going to repeat. But other ones, other ones are just funny. But it's like it's like some of the ones that were said when I was growing up. You can't say now. You cannot say now. You would get in serious trouble now. Unlike him, really, to play the ball straight to the opposition. Which is the Firmino one? Is he just the Bob oh, Bobby Firmino? That one. Looking for a through ball. Here's a shot. Not frightened at going for goal from a tight angle there. Yeah, it was tight, but he caught it well. Not a bad effort. Yep, there's that one as well, Ethan. That's a bad pass. Oh, that's even worse control. Guided through. Well, this could be dangerous in a wide position. Sabiri <laughs> overrunning because he's tired. Chat. Oh, make some changes. Oh, that one is brilliant. Yes. That one is freaking hilarious but again I can't put I can't allow that to go into chat Ethan but yes that one I think that was Newcastle fans as well that did that one might have been Newcastle fans No, no, it's, cheers, mate. Adam but no, that that what that one is freaking hilarious. is on the break. Can we get it in for Obafemi? He's knackered. Obafemi, left foot. No, scuffs it. There's something. Okay, yeah, that's a good one. I still think Man United still have a couple of absolute beauties. The Nick Nat Paddywhack one that we do is funny. But I, I, yeah, obviously, yeah. But there's the, the, the funniest ones that I've seen live was I went to Man United versus Rangers in the Champions League back when Phil Neville was still playing football and Peter Lovenkrantz was still playing for um, for Rangers. So dating myself there at mid 2000s something like that, and I think I think. I think that what you call it, that, um, that Van Nistelrooy was on the score sheet that day. But anyway, um, I still remember it quite well that 
United were winning, and it was the same time as what Rangers and Salty were honestly talking about uh, coming and joining the Football League, the English League. And it got to the stage, like, say, 60 minutes, United were cruising. I think they just scored the second goal. Or they'd been holding on after the second goal had been scored, and Rangers weren't looking like they were going to do anything. And the United fans just started singing, Premier League, you're having a laugh. Premier League, you're having a laugh. And then, five minutes later, they started Championship, you're having a laugh. Championship, you're having a laugh. For a good couple of minutes. And then it said, non-league, you're having a laugh. <laughs> you're having a laugh. Non-league, you're having a laugh. And then, I think it was the, must have been like the 85th, close to the 90th minute, they then said, Sunday league, you're having a laugh. And it was one of the funniest ones because it's just everyone, everyone, it started off in a small section, obviously, then everyone in the stadium was singing it. And hearing pretty much a pretty full Old Trafford sing that was flipping hilarious because they just went Premier League, Championship, Unibond, not non-league, they said Unibond because that's what the, 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 the thingy non-league was sponsored by then, not this Vanarama rubbish, it was sponsored by Unibond, um, and then it was Sunday League. And it was, it was hilarious, don't get me wrong. I just couldn't stop laughing, and I wanted and I wanted Rangers to win that game because I Rangers were are my sec, were my second team at that point because I love Petal Offenkrantz. You know, it was just it was just fun. And that was the door. So hang on, two seconds, guys. Is that the door? Yeah. Oh, sorry, I thought that was the door. No. Turns out it wasn't the door. Oh, well. Okay, so what I've got to do is settings. Camera, audio, commercial language. Gotta be Spanish. I want to go Brazilian. Do I have to download? Do I have to download? Oh, well, I've done that. Wrong headset. I've got to download the Brazilian. I might have to have a look at that because I might have to download the Brazilian one but anyway, we'll keep it we'll keep it as Spanish for this game and we'll figure out whether this is the one that's funny <laughs> that's fair enough I'll have a I'll have a look see if it is um, the Spanish one but it might be a case if I need to download an additional pack um, for the Brazil well, again, I'll have a look for you. Give why I've not been impressed with you so far, so. We'll, we'll try Spanish and see what Spanish sounds like. If Spanish is funny, then yeah, it's good. Dab on, do hit. Dab on those haters. How do you dab? Dab? No? I know how to dab, I'm just taking a look. Chat, you know, it's 60 rated. For that? Oh, for getting up to 60 rated, chat. Oh, we've got to upgrade you now. Ankle tape. There we go. <laughs> oh, yeah, the let's pretend, the let's pretend we scored a goal. Yes. That's good. Yeah, they'll have to do that all the time. Because we don't score many. All the time you have to do that.
tell you one thing that will I will notice. Red Band, I you've just put on hemos perdido ya la cuenta de los goles que ha marcado este jugador. Hoy vamos a disfrutar de un partidazo y un jugadorazo. Dale Manolo. That is just weird. He mean a Spanish announcer. Throw it to the Spanish announce table. But anyway, I, I don't know what you're talking about with TOTKS. Not team of the knockout. Oh, no. I don't know. I don't. I, I don't play Ultimate Team, so I have not a clue, Royal Redman. <laughs> this might be just for any Spanish speaking people this might just sound normal and this is just like the list then listening to us speak is funny oh that was close I need to score a goal I know I tried then I think what, what, what should we shall we just go around the, the random languages like every game now we'll just pick another language <laughs> the pinda oh come on chat come on chat chat <laughs> nearly I hope we're the first ones to score and we don't concede because I don't Saque de Manda! Oop, no! There we go, nice one, Andy. Oh, it's a terrible pass. We've done better now. Oops. That was a terrible cross. Come on. Concentrate, focus. Puede seguir avanzando. Soberbia al cruce. I was waiting for the, just to sort of hear someone say Ben. Oh, look at the strides from Chat. That's not too bad. It's not quite. It might be the Brazilian one. Eh. Eh. It was good. I was expecting him to go a bit more mental, if I'm being honest. Oh, yeah, definitely. When Messi, kind of Messi, kind of Messi, kind of Messi, 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 Messi. Literally, the entire he says Messi about fifty million times all the way through it. He sounds like um, a a, 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 a six-year-old that packed Messi. Have they changed the the modifier for the for the, the what you call it? The lobbed cross. I always thought it was LB L1. It really does. Ah, no. 
Yeah. Messi, Messi. He, he honestly, he's he, either that or he sounds like he's had, a, he sounds like he's having an orgasm. Hello. Marcus and Spencer's. If you see one of those black chicks. Okay. See you later. Love you. Sorry? It was chicken and bacon and I think it was, it was, I don't know if it says chicken, bacon and Caesar or chicken and Caesar or just chicken and bacon. I would <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Sorry. The wife's just popping out shopping, so. Oh, we're nearly going through again. Oh, that's true. And then you've got the, the what you've got the you've got the, the typical Gary Neville when Torres scores when he goes it's just it's 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 hentai. <laughs> it's unbelievable. <laughs> Salah scored. Oh the oh yeah, because he was oh flipping, yeah. The Egyptian commentator when Salah scores. Well, it makes me laugh. Is I'll try and find it on YouTube after this. There's a guy who um, does baseball, Jeff uh, J um, John Sterling, I think his name is for the Yankees. He, he, and but he, it's not funny, but it's like cheesy dad jokes kind of thing. Because obviously every Yankee player that's hits a home run, he has their own little chant for him. Like, it's like. The, the other the other day, a guy called Brett Garner hit a grand slam. Oh dear no! And um, and he goes, it's starting a Gardy party, you know, a bit like Vardy party. And then he Gardner, he plants one in the upper deck. It's just it's my kind of my kind of humour. Oh, nice ball. Over them. Oh, can we sort of it in? Sabiri! That's a better one. That's what I was expecting! That's the one I was kind of expecting you to say. No! That's the one I was expecting. I'm not surprised that one that one annoyed you, Chris, because it's been a, a Liverpool fan. But it was a good goal that was. What a way to announce yourself on the scene. That was a long start. I think we're definitely going to. Next games, we're, we're just going to change the commentator and just have it on different different languages. I'm going to go Italian next. Oh yeah, that that Aguero one. Yep. Rafael Antonio. The Benteke one. I can't remember the Benteke one. Yeah, I can't remember the Benteke one. Oh! Sorry, yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa! Jeez! That, I do not care that I conceded that. What a freaking goal! What 
a goal. Exactly, say I bottled it with those two goals. The first one. the ball in the middle middle of the park and then I can't get it back. I don't know and Grantley um perhaps you should ask someone else to do that for you. That just grandly if you're going to come in and just do that then I'd rather you not be part of the channel so please don't bother says there's no such thing as momentum in this game. A shin scraper. Well, he did hit his knee and then rolled down, didn't he? We've got a penalty. We have. Get in. Come on, chat. We're in the same. I don't know. I'll go that way, and then that way. And he saved it. Great. <sighs> Looks like we've got some idiots this morning. It's, it's, a Friday, it's a Friday morning, it's half past ten. You would think that the idiots would be in sleep, asleep. Or, or, actually, or actually bothering someone that has actually got more more subs. You know. You, you know, you would, they, would, they would go and bother someone who's actually like more successful. Good morning, Eugene. No, 
Ah, don't worry about it, Chris. It's fine. Just it, it's stuff like that. Just ignore it. You know. That's I I I just like leave me to deal with it because I'll just put them in timeout or I'll ban them. I've got the tools to do it. It's pointless just filling chat with negativity. It, it no, it totally will be, Ricky. It totally will be. And that's and that's and that's the scare and that's the the, the really. That's just it's nothing new, Gene. I'm not even going to talk about. It. I'm not going to talk about. It. It's just people being just people being internet idiots. Yeah, that's exactly it. That's exactly it, Redman. The worst thing you can do to people like that is actually give them attention. Get in. Hi, Isaac. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, I gathered the last bit was. They think it's cool to be a, a keyboard warrior. Yeah, it's exactly it. It's exactly it. And it's like, I'm, it's like, I'm, I'm 30. I don't understand what you mean by that, Eugene. It's like, I'm 33. You know, it's not funny. <laughs> I don't care. I do this because he's funny. Exactly, he's like, of course I remember you. You've been an OG. You've been an OG member of the stream for a while. You keep popping in and out. It's good fun. Always enjoy when you're here. Um, you know, I'm 33 years old. So what's the point? Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. I get what you mean now, Eugene. I don't. I don't need this kind of crap. You know, it's fun. Did I just? No, I didn't forget that much. Unfortunately, I get reminded daily how I all that. Yeah, I don't need this kind of stuff. I'll have a look at that one on YouTube. Never heard of Charlie Poop. Yes, we did. And we're going to be changing it to Italian for the next one. Because we can. So why not? Nice to pull this back. Well done. Chat. I made a mistake, I made a mistake. Oh, come on. Hopefully move. Lines it up. Cheers, Eugene. Lined it up. I've got to try. I've got to try to time shot from that. I've got to because I think that's probably a little bit better from that. That's the only time that I think the time shot would work better. Who's my best player, Isaac? My best player on stats wise is Bentley, but at the minute it's um, it's um, between. I, I feel more comfortable using either over Femi or um, Nikita. Nikita from Arsenal. But obviously we've got to put Bender in because he's the lord. This weekend's going to be so hot for me and my mates, we just had to go to the, to the cost for three days starting tomorrow. Just having a drink, like, noise. 
Está claro que el equipo de casa hoy ha estado bien y por eso se lleva los tres puntos. Ya hemos hablado antes de su potencial yeah. goleador, Manolo, y hoy lo han vuelto a demostrar. Definitely. Definitely. That sounds like a great weekend, that does. That sounds like a great weekend, Chris. And Redman, that... Yeah, you're right. It's good. I mean, I'm in beach, not coast. You meant the coast. So you're only an A out, really. Ajax. Definitely. Ajax definitely uh, uh, for the team of the group stage. Definitely uh, team of the, that first knockout. There you go, coach. Okay, so now settings again. You call you support a team called Big Man United. Big Man YouTube. What? Okay, so Spanish, Italian. We're going for the Italian. We're going for the Italian broadcasters next, because I I literally hope there's someone that just goes. Oh, if they don't, then I'm just going to quit FIFA. I'm in goal. Oh dear, I feel sorry for you. Only five, eight. Who's going to think they're going to win the Champions League and Europa League? Europa League, I, I will be honest with you now. The Europa League, um, Isaac, I don't know. I think Arsenal have a decent chance, but you Arsenal usually bottle it. So, I don't know on that one. Um, I do think, though, that... I do think that... Chelsea stand a chance. Chelsea stand the better chance out of the two English players. The two, two English players, sorry, two English teams. Champions League, I want Liverpool, Ajax, or Tottenham to win. If it's if it's it, if it's English people, Finn, you're making me a little bit concerned about what you're saying all the time. Um, but yeah, I'm a little bit unnerved by what you're saying, so I don't know what you mean. But for me, I, I would like I would like Ajax to win because it's good. But if an English if English team is in the final, I'm going to support the English team because I have no real hatred for Liverpool. I don't like them, but I don't have overall hatred for them. And Tottenham, I think it'd just be nice for Tottenham to win something. Eccolo qui, il capo cannoniere del campionato, certamente tra i protagonisti annunciati di questo match. Hey, Ajax beat Juventus, and Juventus have no mugs. Just a minute silence in Italy. Oh, no, there Oh dear, that guy on the left does not look good. This is kind of full. Shall we just go around and say every single team has crashed? Keeper, keeper, keeper. That's a good. That's a good question. Hughes. Okay. Oh, this is good. This is good listening to them say English. Oh, good defender. Who's? Seems like the Italians got paid to, to, to say names more than to commentate at this time. Sunderland? You might want to watch him. Um, Müller! <laughs> like I was just shouting, Müller! Oakley Boots. 
Oh, can I do it? Oh. <laughs> oh, how could he be so lucky? Oh dear. Yeah, definitely the Italian one is not uh, so far. Well, no one scored yet, but so far the Spanish, the Spanish one was more entertaining. But the Italian one, the, the way that they're pronouncing English names, it's quite funny. Oh wow, that was a bit of a, that was a bit of an adventurous tackle. Guys, can we? Right, I will put a stop to this now. Rangelov! <laughs> Rangelov! Yeah. Uh, let's, let's stop team bashing now, guys. Let's stop team bashing now. It's fine that you're, you're, everyone, everyone is allowed to support who they want to, but respect other people's decisions. Oh, Oakley Booth. Great play. Disappointing Italian rep, Italian commentators. No real big thing. No. Oh come on! Oh, disappointing. So disappointing. That's so disappointing. No real big sound. He's just a goal. Oh, all right, fair enough. Done. Guys, let, let, how, how about we talk about some real football, okay? Okay, that was a good goal. Let's talk about some real football, yeah? Wrexham. Real football. Real football. Let's talk about Wrexham in the Vanarama Champ National League. Running away with the league. Running away with it. Hanno pareggiato dunque 1-1. Ragna Vetri. Ah, it's 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 pure football. Bravo qui il difensore che spazza via. No free kick. Okay, ref. Thank you. Come on, McNeil, get there. Recupera palla. Hold on. Molly clears it. Palla che esce, push, rimessa laterale. Oba Femi. Free kick, thank you. Yeah, Harry, it is unfortunately. It is definitely red. Oh, it's penalty. Right, this time we're going that way. Oh, he saved it again. Changed the fucking way of gone twice now. Oh, it's fine, I know, but... 
some people don't take it as banter. That's they just thought I'd try and stop it before he went a little bit too far. That's all I was thinking. No, that's not good. Some people just want to come in for an argument, and I don't get it. So you just come in, just thinking, right, this person says they're a fan of this, then I'm just going to go poop on their parade. You know, it's just... It's like, no, they're not open to a, just a discussion that um, people are allowed to have. You know, opinions that are contrary to them because it's the internet. That's what I don't get. And that is my biggest, that is my problem with the internet. No one is allowed a contrary opinion without being called an idiot. It's annoying. Oh, beautiful ball. Severi, please get that. No. Lucky. Exactly right. That that Man City Spurs game is a perfect testament of what the Champions League should be all about. Oh, chat! You've missed it again. Free kick, please, on the edge of the box. That was ridiculous. Hi, Ollie. Hope you're doing well. Thank you very much for coming and joining the stream. We've got McNeil. Oh, now. Okay, said so he's patched that. They patched it. I wouldn't exactly say City were robbed, but um, it was a, sh a harsh decision. Oh, he did the post again. Finn, behave. That's all I'll say. Just behave. They did, no, that is put completely, that is completely right. And I like the fact that the second leg was as open as what it was. It just showed that Tottenham still wanted it as much. It's usually in those second legs, with you being 1 0 from the first leg. Yeah, but Finn, the reason why I asked you to calm down is because you're the only one that I'm seeing that's using massive language. No. No, I, I, the thing is that, uh, as well there, Isaac, is that I haven't had a free kick in that kind of position for a while, so I wanted to see whether the, what you call it, the patch has gone. Because that has always worked, and it's always been an exploit that I've had. So it's like in FIFA 18 and then up to 19, up to this point, I've always been able to do that and get a goal quickly and cheaply. So why would I why would I bother taking a free kick legitimately if that has always worked? Because the game cheats it, cheats against me anyway by the stupid momentum glitch and the flipping whatever he does with the head is when he wants to. That, that central defender has blocked me about more than I can see. 
Finn, and that's the reason why I'm not, I'm, I'm pulling you up. And I was paying attention more to you than the game. It's because you say stuff like that. So, shut up. <laughs> if I ask you, don't call for other people to get banned and that if you're going to keep saying stuff like that because you're going to be the only one that ends up getting banned. So, chat shit, get banned. Oh, great finish by Oberfem. Anna, I agree with you, Royal. I don't care. It, it, it is, but the amount of swearing that's already gone on, it is what it is. It was a PG stream up until, uh, up until I got frustrated, really frustrated. Nah, don't give me a reason. I'll be the one that decides it. And it might seem unfair to some people, but... It, if it's the reason that I've picked, then that's all I've got to deal with. Come on, chat. Penalty. Another one. Both of you. Royal, don't don't engage in it. It's pointless. I don't know anymore. Harry, I hope, and I hope he goes through. And I, ho I hope you do. I hope you the IX game is just. You're not. I'm just saying. I'm not saying you get. I'm not saying you're getting banned. I'm just saying if you carry on, you're on the road to get banned, because you're constantly just. You're calling for other people to get banned for chatting rubbish, and then you're the one that's putting all explanatory in full caps in chat, which is getting blocked by my bot. So that's. So you can't. You see what I mean? It's like you call people out for doing this and yet you still do it yourself and you expect no comeuppance on yourself. Take a look at what you're saying and what other people are saying, put it into context and then go, maybe I shouldn't be saying the things that I'm saying. Ajax versus Tottenham is going to be a good one, but Liverpool-Barcelona is one that I'm not going to miss. Yep, yeah, well, you're annoying me, so deal with it. That's a good goal. That's a good goal, bad defending by me. No, no, no. Finn's on about red man and um, I'm on about Finn. Free kick, ref, no? Okay, fair enough. Spurs want love for Yeah, oh no, they do. Definitely. I don't see. Thing is, I see Liverpool beating. I see Liverpool beating Barcelona. I don't see Spurs beating Barcelona, but I see Spurs beating Liverpool. Does that make sense? I don't think it makes sense, but. I, I, Oh, good head gives right. Sabiri. Il quarto uomo indica tre minuti di recupero. 
You've made your point, Finn. You've said that Redman was annoying you. That's your say. You've had it. And now Redman's got on with it and he's just talking normally in chat, which is what I want you to do. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's good. And that's going to be a problem. Milner will play. I think it's Milner will play. Milner will play. And um, Milner will have a good game. And Milner will probably mark Messi and someone out of it. And unfortunately, we lose that game. Taking your headset off. And moved it back to England. Back to English. Because that Italian one was rubbish. And I don't hold any hope out for the rest of them because Spanish one was just pure jokes but yeah unfortunately we lose that one and that's partly my fault for getting distracted but you know it is what it is it's part of the reason why why we do this and we're still top though still top after 13 games and chat you are starting to get there I just wish your stamina I haven't got stamina on there I haven't got stamina on there um time we on oh 11 o'clock yeah i will be i didn't realize the time so yeah i will be ending the stream yep yeah, definitely and the thing that milner does well is what ander herrera kind of does for united is that he can mark um can mark a player out of the game and he can silence them a little bit just making sure that I put this back to English first, because otherwise I get confused next time I'm playing. Uh, English subtitles off. That's fine. Oh, sideline commentator. Unable to several get here. All your yeah, go on. I'll do that. It's fine. What? Really? Well, to be perfectly honest. I was gonna have I was gonna get reminded soon anyway, but um, because I've got a little notification on my phone to set up at just after eleven, so I would have seen that anyway. But because it's five to, you know, it hasn't come up yet. I, I, I tell you what, Redman, if there's if you put two men on Messi, then you kind of you're kind of taking yourself out of your entire your entire um, philosophy of Liverpool. So that's your problem if you end up doing that, if you end up putting two men on him. But if you have, say, Milner playing in um, holding midfield or Fabinho, one of the two, then you can put a squeeze on Messi without really overloading your shape. And I think and I think Mini um, think it would probably do that probably better. You know. But that's just the way it is. It's Twitch, what's the warning? Okay, fair enough. Gotta change that setting. Fair enough, I'll do that in the game afterwards. So, um, thank you very much, guys. This is going to be the end of the stream now. So I'm just going to close down all of the, the windows that I've got open. Because I don't need them anymore. So thank you very much for watching, everybody. Thank you for all the new people that have come in. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, hit the like button. And subscribe if you want to or only if you want to so this will be going live in a little bit as a reminder there is no stream tomorrow morning and there won't be a stream later on today I'm at Vale this afternoon and I've got friends coming around this evening so no time unfortunately to stream today um, we're not streaming tomorrow morning because I've got to do some adult stuff but depending on how things go um, oh no I'm out tomorrow Oh, I don't think I'm going to be able to get a stream in at all tomorrow. That sucks. Um, but we will be like, if I can't get a stream in at all on Saturday, then I definitely will get one done on Sunday morning. So I'll try. So thank you very much, guys, for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. If you have, do the usual. Have an awesome day, and I'll see you when I see you.